So today I'm going to be talking about what's in my backpack and what I kind of bring with me every day to class and just overall kind of like tips on how to stay organized and all of that. So enjoy. So to begin, I have a High Sierra backpack. So it's just gray and this teal color and I got it from TJ Maxx for like $16. Um, it was like their out of season label. So it was like normally 30 and then I got it for 16. I don't know what it means when it says out of season, but whatever. So it just brought it to a bigger sale, I guess. In the big pocket, I obviously have my laptop. As a college student, it's just a lot easier to have your own laptop. Um, a lot of dorms and on-campus apartments will have like a computer lab with um, like access to all of your stuff and then you can like print for like 10 cents a page or something. But I just like to have my own laptop so that I can just be in the comfort of my own apartment. Um, it has this Kin Mac. Kin Mac case that my boyfriend got me from Amazon and I know so many people with this case so it's a very common case and then I just have my MacBook Air inside of it. I swear by five subject notebooks so every semester I've been getting the five subject notebook by five star and it just has like these um, inside of each section to keep it organized into your five sections. Let's say I like leave my apartment or you leave your dorm or whatever and you go to Starbucks and you don't have all of your notebooks but you don't have time to go back to your dorm and get all of them and like study. Um, it's kind of like inconvenient so having it all in one like organized compartmented like notebook you can go anywhere and study like spontaneously and be able to have everything with you just in case you need to flip from like one subject to another so it's super convenient and then I also have this stay golden um, pencil bag that I got from TJ Maxx for I think like three dollars so um, the five star notebooks are like I think like six to ten dollars so I think it depends on where you go, but I usually get it like six, seven dollars. But um, anyways, I got this from TJ Maxx. And in this, I have every color of everything ever. I'm a very colorful person, and I think that the best way to study is to have as many colors as you can. I have never heard someone say that like doing everything in pencil helps them the best. Normally people, when they just use one color, it's just because they they don't feel like switching from this color to that and highlighting this and highlighting that. But I'm sure that if you get all these different colored pens and all these different color highlighters, you will succeed. I haven't gotten the thick highlighters in a really long time. I always have like the thin ones. So this semester, well this year, I got the thick ones in all these different colors. And then of course you need mechanical pencils. And I obviously have an eraser. This one's an old eraser that I just had from last semester. So I couldn't really find my other one because they usually come in like packs of two. But I have this one and it works just fine. So whatever. Last but not least, all of these pens. Yes, I have a thousand different colored pens because I, again, color coordinate everything. So that just fits conveniently all in here. And another really good organization tip is to have an agenda and a slash planner. This one says I'll pencil you in and I got this one from TJ Maxx for $9.99. So it's super cute and it's small and I always get this like kind because it has all of your months labeled with tabs so you can flip to it. So we'll go to, we'll go to August. So in the beginning, it has a quote and then it has a layout of your whole month. So in the layout, you can say August to do's, birthdays, and other important dates. So my August goal is to start sophomore year strong and then I have all of my to do's. Flip a page and it has all of your days just blocked out like this. And there's always a quote on top and then you flip to the next one and there's another quote and it has individual days so you can do each day um, and have little to do's that you can check off and mark off for the each individual day of the week. And still in the big pocket I have just a calculator that I ordered off of Amazon. It's just the Texas Instruments one. 
This is usually approved in all of my classes. And last but not least in the big pocket, I have my Kaplan Nursing Entrance Exam Study Guide. So this is just like 375 pages of what I need to know to do good on the test and succeed and try my hardest. And in my small pocket, right here, I have a charger for my laptop and then I just have a little mini stapler, um, a whiteout, and then just a cute little notepad. But that's really it. That's all I keep in my backpack. So for me, by minimizing how many notebooks I use and by keeping everything organized, I feel more organized and I feel like I can be more productive because I have everything with me, but it's not like a big mess of like, here's this notebook and this notebook and this notebook. Oh no, I forgot this notebook at my apartment. I just said notebook so many times. It's just really important to have everything organized your way so that you can succeed in the best way possible. A couple more things that I always carry with me is my hydro flask because especially where I go to school in Flagstaff, when you go up to a higher altitude, you're able to get more dehydrated quicker. And I don't have all of this stuff that I have in my hands right now in my backpack yet because I still have it in my purse because I don't bring around a purse at school. I obviously put everything in my backpack, but I also like to have hand sanitizer. I have really, really dry lips. So by having um, a chapstick with me wherever I go, is just super helpful and I feel like I don't have to run around and go try to find a chapstick. So by having one with me all the time, one or two, your preference, I am a hydrated mama. And last but not least, this is just from Victoria's Secret. I got it on sale when they were having like their sale, their big sale. I got it for like $7. I think it's normally $14. So really it's not that bad, but it's really cute. And so I have my credit card and my debit card in here, obviously, and then I have my student ID and my driver's license. Um, and then I'm going to be taking this off soon, my key set, because I'm not driving my car up there. That's all that I wanted to show you guys today. I hope that the little tips and tricks that I kind of threw in there helped you a little bit. Organization is like such a big part of my life because I feel like if I'm not organized, my whole day's thrown off and I'm not really sure like what I'm gonna do next or what homework I have. So by writing things down, color coordinating everything, having everything in one spot, like my notebook for example, everything's just in one notebook, I feel like I can have the easiest time of being organized, which saves time for me so that I don't have to worry about if I'm forgetting anything. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you want, give it a thumbs up, you know whatever they say <laughs> please so yeah thanks for watching